Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna be doing a little bit of a different vid. I was a little bit unsure of what video to make. I looked through my requested DMs and saw that some of you guys wanted a car tour. First of all, my car is not very clean. Warning you guys, I didn't get a car wash in a while. Um, so ignore that. Um, I'm only doing a car tour because, you know, people are interested in car tours. I actually really like watching car tours, but it's not meant to be like me showing off, if you know what I mean. I'm 100% not showing off. I've been driving for almost three years. I work, I go to school, so a car is such a necessity around here. I recently got this car for my 19th birthday. It's a Mazda 3, it's a 2013. It had about 28,000 kilometers on it, which is really good for a 2013 car, so it was in really good condition when I got it. And yeah, so I'm just gonna do a little tour for you guys. I'm gonna go outside first, show you the exterior of the car. And then we're just gonna get inside and I'll show you all the cute fun pieces of trash I have in here and just some fun stuff like that. So let's get right into it. So this is the exterior of the car. It's like a light grayish color. Light gray? No, dark gray, sorry. This is how it looks. I don't have tinted windows so it's really awkward because everybody looks into my car and tries to talk to me a little bit. That's how the back looks. And this is the other side. Cute, fun, fresh. Let me pop the trunk quickly. I have pretty much just um, clothes back there. Ooh, fun. But this is all the clothes that I want to donate. It's been back here for a really long time and I don't think it was smart that I put it in my trunk because I never see it. And the whole point was to put it in there so I wouldn't forget to donate it and I always forget. It's really spacious back here. Um, I can fit a good amount of stuff. Down here is where the spare is. Not too sure what this thing is, so I'm just gonna leave it. Nice and spacious, could put a couple bodies back here. Just kidding, sorry, that was a bad joke. So I guess we'll start with the back of the car where my bitches go. And by bitches, I mean my friends. We've got a nice amount of dirt on the ground because whenever I go to the beach, my friends like to shake all the sand on the ground, which is really good. I have a box for a little car mount thing that I got. This is my little bag of trash, which I'm going to be honest with you guys. I just got this bag right now so I could take the trash out of my car and put it all in here so it looks like I'm, you know, organized and responsible. Here I have a jacket, just in case I get cold. I always keep this in here. I think I forgot it one day and I decide it's gonna be my car jacket. The interior just looks like this. It's black um, material. You can like pull the seats down here to open up the back so the trunk's a little bit bigger. Right here is the lock. Um, yeah, it just flicks. It just flicks just like so. Nice little cup holder. Guys, also, I had a question because I recently had a debate with Marga that the side cup holders are supposed to be where you put your garbage, but she thinks that the center cup holder is where you put your garbage. We had a big debate about it, and um, my friends agreed with her. So I just wanna know what you guys think. If you agree with me, let me know. If not, don't say anything. Thank you. This is what the front looks like from the back. And yeah, this is a good spot to give an overview, so I guess we'll do that right now. People can massage me as I'm driving. Nobody does it, but it would be nice. I think I've given you enough overviews of the back, so let's go to the front. Ugh. So I'm turning the car on because I'm sweating really good. Someone's backing up onto my driveway. Yeah, you better leave. So here we've got a couple more buttons. Oh my gosh, she scared the shit out of me! Okay, so now these control the windows. Where'd she go? Oh, she went back inside, okay, awkward. I get to control all the windows. If anyone's acting up, I'll tell them to put their finger out there and then I'll shut the window. So over here we just have, I don't know, I think this is the traction thing. So then right here, we've got just your basic, um, you know, I don't know the terminology of any of this, but I'll put it right here. 
Then we have the windshield wiper business, which is good. And we've also got the headlights. So I don't know what this area is called, but I'll also put the terminology right here. This is just the, oh, control panel, is that right? So we have the radio, AM, FM, CD, satellite, and then the aux cord. My aux cord's right here. This was the mount that I bought that just goes on here so I can stick my phone here. Up here is the little um, display, it has the time, it also has the music when I play it, it also has the temperature. So then when you want to play some music, you just go like this. Oh, okay. When you change the volume, it glows up, so it's my favorite part. It's really cute and precious. And obviously the air conditioning and heating down here. So in the center thing, I hold a few items. So I'll show you guys what's in here. This is kind of just like my safety little thing. I have some safety pair of sunglasses in case I forget to bring a pair. Those are like my car sunglasses. I have an extra cord in here, a box, and then one of these coin thingies that I don't really use. We have another outlet there and then there's a USB plug and an aux cord here. This is my little like safety makeup. Not not even makeup, just like my little safety thing. Usually I have a pair of contacts in here which is my biggest thing. I wear contact lenses all the time and I don't wear glasses ever. Um, but I used my emergency pair already so I gotta put another pair in here. So I got hand cream. Bath and Body Works hand cream, pretty sure. And I have these two like little things I got from Sephora, the face cleanser from First Aid Beauty and a Ultra Repair Hydrating Sleeping Cream, which is just a moisturizer. I keep this just in case I'm sleeping at a friend's house. I also have one earplug. I think that was an accident. I have lip gloss. This is a Lancome Juicy Tube. I have a little bit of Sunday perfume. Oh. I love Justin. One single Q-tip. I think I actually have a pair of tweezers in here. This is so smart. Didn't know I had these. I don't use this little safety kit too often, but I have a pair of tweezers. I'm such a genius. I forget these kinds of things. That's everything that's in here. Then we come down to the passenger seat. We have a couple things down here. Honestly, these are the shoes that I wear to work, but I don't actually like wear them ever So the fact that I can keep them in my car is okay because I'll just change into them right before work I still have this box of Triscuits, which is like my snack if I go somewhere and I'm hungry But I'm pretty sure they're stale now so I can throw them away these pairs of heels because they didn't fit in my bag one time And then once I took them out of my bag I just kept forgetting to bring them with me and then I have an umbrella So yeah, not too complicated now in this front thing oh my god so sorry about that I have a half-eaten protein bar obviously I have my insurance and in here I have a little Mazda booklet so it has all of the things if I ever need to learn something about this car it's in here yeah, I just have my napkins oh my god I have a lollipop shit and then I have tape whenever I do drive with me I use that tape to stick my camera right here. So I really think that that's everything for this car tour. Sorry if you're grossed out by the amount of dirt I have in my car. I haven't done like an interior cleaning of it uh, since I got it, so. Let me know what other videos that you do wanna see on my channel. If you're not subscribed to my channel, then don't forget to subscribe down below. Go check out my other videos. I do a lot more other than car tours if this is your first time on my channel. Okay guys, it was great to see you. I have to go to work in an hour, so I'm gonna go make that cash money. Okay, bye guys, love you.